Welcome back to my channel, Math and Language, and we're going to discuss how to add mixed numbers to proper fraction. So, pag add tayo na mixed numbers, so ito yung 3 and 1 fifth na to, at yung mixed number, ayan, kasi may whole number siya, at may proper fraction here. Combination, that will be mixed number. I tapos, ito naman ay proper fraction, kasi mas mababa yung numerator dun sa denominator. Okay, so, paano natin siyang i-add? So, the first thing you will do is you have to change the mixed number to improper fraction. Ito yung common way. So, uh, I'll show you two techniques. Okay, so, magali ko muna itong mga bilog na to. So, the first technique is you can add uh, change mo muna sa improper fraction that will be 5 times 3 tapos 15 plus mo 1 that will be 6 over 5 ngayon pwede mo na silang i-add so you can see the similar fraction sila kasi um, yung denominator nila iba so pakita ko sila paano, ma paano natin siya sasagutan so pag ganito uh, butterfly method na lang will be 16 times 3 48 Plus mo 2 times 5, that will be 10. Over mo 5 times 3, 15. So, ang sagot dyan is 48 plus 10, that will be 8. Divided by 15. At di ba naman pwedeng i-divide ng 3, yung 58 or 5. Kaya, lowest term na yan. 5 plus 8, that. So, this is already the lowest term. Um, so, sa 3 and 1 fifth plus 2 thirds ay 58 over 15. Now, sometimes your yung teacher mo sabihin, ah, kailangan ano yan, mixed number. Di, di siya tumatanggap ng, ng improper fraction. So, you have to change it. So, 58, divide mo ng 15. Ilang 15 meron sa 58? Tatlo. So, it be 45. So, 58 minus 45, 13. Tapos, remainder, 13. Kasi mas pataas ang 15 sa 13, di ba? So again, pag ganyan, yung quotient mo, yung 3, that will be the whole number. At yung remainder mo na 13, that will be the numerator. Sorry, 13 to. That will be the numerator. At yung divisor mo naman, that will be the denominator. So ito yung final answer. 3 over, 3 and 13, 15. Now, I'll show you the other technique. So, paano naman kapag... Kaling. Paano naman kapag yung, yung isang method? Think ko lang to. Isang method is, i-ignore mo yung whole number. Pwede naman yun, ignore mo lang. Ito mo lang muna tignan mo. So, 1 fifth plus... 1 fifth plus mo ng thirds. So, mag-butterfly method 3. Plus mo ng 2 times 5, that will be 10. Tapos ito, 5 times 3, 15. That will be 13 over 15, di ba? Ngayon, doon mo na ipapalagay yung whole number. 3 and 13, 15. So it's up to you kung gusto mong i-ignore mo muna yung whole number. O gawin mo na siyang improper fraction yung mixed number. Either the two. So let's have another example. Paano naman kapag, okay, I'll have another example, 2 and 1, 7, so plus mo ng 3, 3, 4. So, let's uh, apply the first method, yung gagawing improper fraction mo na siya. So, 7 times 2, that will be 14, plus 1, 15, 15 over 7. Tapos, add natin yung 3, 4. Ngayon, pag ganyan, butterfly method na lang natin, 15 times 4, that will be 60. 3 times 7, that will be 21. 7 times 4, that will be 28. That will be 81, over mo ng 28. Hindi, um, this is already the lowest term, kasi wala, wala sa ng GCF. So yung 81 is 3, pwede sa 3. Ang 28, di naman pwede sa 3. So 4, hindi rin. So there. That's already the final answer. But again, sabi ko nga kanina, 
yung instructor nyo or yung teacher nyo, gusto niya mixed number to. So, 81 divide mo ng 28. So, lang 28 meron sa 81. Sige, check natin sa kalik. So, dalawa. Dalawa lang. 2 times 28, that will be 56. 81 minus 56, may 14. Sige, 70. Plus 10, 24, 25. Check na rin natin para sure. <laughs> 81 minus 1 ng 56. Yes, 25. Remainder mo ng 25 to. So, again, itong 2, that will be the whole number sa mixed number. Itong remainder na 25, that will be the numerator. And the divisor, that will be the, the denominator. So, ito na yung final answer. Now, let's apply naman yung isa. Paano kapag, ang tawag dito? Yung, ignore natin yung uh, whole number. Ignore natin yung whole number. Tanggalin ko lang to. So, papansinin ko lang itong 1,7 plus mo ng 3, 4. Ganyan. So, 1 times 4, that will be 4. 3 times 7, that will be 21. At 7 times 4, that will be 28. And we have 25 over 1 and 28. So, copy mo lang yung 2 dito. There you have it. Diba? Madali lang. Okay. Now, uh, let's have another example. Paano kapag medyo uh, mas mahirap na example? Let's have it. So, 5 uh, let's say 8 over 9. Tapos gusto mo ng 7 over 8. Okay. So let's apply the first method. Yung first method natin, yung gawin muna siyang improper fraction. So ganyan, multiply mo. 9 times 5, 45. Plus 8. 45 plus 8, 53. 53 over 9 to. Ngayon, a-add mo ng 7, 8. You can do the butterfly method kasi medyo malaki na yung numero na to. So, uh, yeah. Okay. Gawin natin. 53 times mo ng 8, 424. Plus mo ng 63. Over mo ng 70. So, 424 plus 63, that will be plus 6487. Yes. 487. Over mo ng 70. Ang 487, that is already the prime. Number? Yes, 8 plus 4, 12, 7. Pag dinibide mo siya ng 3, hindi rin pwede. 4, 6. Pag sa 7, divide mo ng 7. No. So, this is already the prime. 487 divide mo ng 8. No. So, ito na yung sagot. So, let's uh, change it to a uh, mixed number. Pag change mo siya sa mixed number, that will be namang 72. Meron sa 47. Mga 6. So, 6 times 7, sorry, 6 times 72, uh, para mabilis, kakalukin ko na, 432. So, that will be 5, 8 minus 5, then 55. So, the answer will be 6 and 55 over 70. That's already the final answer. Hindi mo na pwedeng E. Uh, lowest term yan, 55, 72. Yes, hindi na. So, paano naman kapag uh, yung ignore natin yung whole number? So, pag ignore natin yung whole number, that will be like this. Ito lang papansinin ko, 8, 9, 8, 9 plus 7, 8. So, 8 times 8, that will be 64. 7 times 9, that will be 63. At yung 9 times 8 natin, that will be 72. So, that will be 127, right? Over man 72. At talaga mo yung 5. Hindi tayo pwedeng mag-accept ng ganito. Uh, improper fraction ka, at may mix, mix number na improper fraction, no? You have to change this one to 
uh, proper fraction. Pa natin gagawin yan. Yung 127 mo, gawin mo mo ng mixed number. So, 172, uh, 5, so 55. Ah, tama, 55. So, remainder 55. That will be 1 and 55 over 72. Ngayon, eto, et, eto, ia-add natin yung 5 dito. So, that will be 6 and 55 over 72. Tama. Kasi, saan ang galing yun, sir? Itong 127 over 72 mo, ito yun. Itong green. 55, 1 and 55, 72. Ngayon, ia-add mo siya sa 5. So, 5 plus 1, ito na yun. Diba? Same lang. Same answer. So, yung sagot sa 5, 5 and 8 over 9, plus 7 over 8, ay 6 and 55 over 72. And that's the end of the lesson on how to add mixed numbers to proper fraction. If you have comments, suggestion, o mag may tanong kayo, any comment, uh, kayo bahala. <laughs> suggestion, comment, just comment down. Again, this is James, your math and language instructor. Please like and subscribe. Malapit na mag 10K, so I would really appreciate kung mag like na kayo. Like na. <laughs> Malapit na mag 10K. Thank you very much. And, and, and para makagawa pa ako ng marami pang videos about math and language. Don't worry, up to calculus, gagawin ka rin. Thank you po. Salamat. Bye.